What's up guys, Black Wolves everyone, welcome back to another video and today we're back on Pro Cycling Manager 2018 for the fourth spade of the 2019 Giro d'Italia between Orbetello and Frascati, uh, just my best ac uh, Italian accent on point, uh, for 230 kilometers roughly um, with a hilly finish. So we're going to have the first sort of battle between uh, the favorites for the GC win and uh, the, the game counts this as a stage that's worth following, so we're gonna see if um, if this statement is true. But uh, before we start, if you haven't seen the previous stages, then I highly recommend you to do so. Um, stage 1 and stage 2 being uh, crucial to understand what's happening uh, for the GC. And without further ado, I'm just going to jump in the race and I'll see you on the line. And we're on our way in Orbetello for the beginning of this fourth stage, 230 kilometers, um, to rejoin the town of Frascati um, in uh, the valley of Italy. I uh, don't know which one. Um, but we've got our boys already at the front of the peloton with, as you can see, Vincenzo Nibali wearing the pink jersey, the Maglia Rosa, uh, of leader of the GC, having... Um, Nearly won the time trial uh, and won stage two in quite an um, unbelievable manner. But uh, yeah, we're leading the GC with uh, with Vincenzo. And um, for now, we're doing good. We are, we're doing quite well. I'm going to show you the GC uh, in a second. Ranking, there we go. So leading Vincenzo Nibali, 10 seconds ahead of Dumoulin, Roglic, Zachary, Miguel Angel Lopez, Yannis Aguirre, Tanel Kanga, Damien, um, Samin Yates, Andrea Maduro, and Damien Caruso is your top 10. Uh, a top 10 that already looks like a GC contending top 10, um, mainly thanks to the first time trial. But um, yeah, we, we shall see what happens. There is already a break. We're going to take a look at who's in it. We have Guillaume Boivin for Israel Cycling Academy. We've got Maestri for Bardiani CSF. And um, just 10 seconds behind, we have a group of five riders with Sean Bennett from EF, Eddie Dunbar from Ineos, um, Ben Gastauer from Azure de Zerla Mondial, Ivan Santaramiza, the former, I think, state winner of the Giro, uh, here riding for Nipo. Uh, no, for Vini Fantini. Yeah, Vini Fantini. And finally, you've got Andrea Van Drame for Andrea Nigurkatoli. And the breakaway is about two minutes ahead as uh, they're going to regroup in uh, in any second. So I'll see you a bit later in stage. All right, so um, I may have missed the KOM, um, but Marco Maestri got top points in uh, the fourth category climb, which puts him on, um, I think he was on two. So if I do some, um, some quick maths, he's now on five. So, uh, breakaway 6 minutes ahead, uh, still 176 kilometers to go. I think like the peloton is going to wake up approximately after the intermediate sprint. Uh, and then we'll reel the, the breakaway away in. And pace uh, during the climb towards uh, Frascati. Um, I think it's a town like famous for science and like physics, which uh, will be interesting. I think it's a very nice place in real life. Alright, so as expected, the rhythm in the peloton has really increased um, for like the past 70 kilometers now. And the breakaway is for the first time under the 2 minute 30 gap. Uh, well, for the first time ever since they were above this gap when the breakaway was created. Um, why is. Yo, Garozio, I don't know why you're in the team. Like, you're absolutely useless. There's a group uh, with riders are dropped, let me guess, Maresco. Yes, get in. Jakub Moreshko has dropped. Pull up, pull up. Uh, who else? No one important because like they're not gonna win today. Like it's it's gonna be a, it's a hard finish today. Um, the entire Androny team is dropped. Solid. Even first to Masnada is dropped. Like please, he's your leader. He's already four minutes fifteen behind. Ah, uh, that's, that's that's very. Disappointing uh, from uh, Androne. I'll have to say that. Alright, 26 kilometers remaining in this stage. Uh, breakaways, less than a minute ahead, and uh, everyone's trying to attack. We had uh, Gastawa attacking, 
he got co op, um, and uh, it's now Marco, no, Andrea Von Drame, who's trying to make a move. And now it's going to be Eddie Dunbar, uh, the rider for Ineos, showing the new jersey as Valerio nearly uh, tries his best to give water to the guys. I mean, you, you've been struggling for the past hour, Chief. Uh, go move on, sprint, but give your guys water. I don't care about, like, your energy. You you could like I don't know just do your thing please you've got one job. Um, but we're approaching now the uh, the final town. I've tried like to gather some intel. Uh, there's nothing that much important uh, apart like science laboratories um, as mentioned. I knew like there was uh, a space thingy. Um, I think they developed. Um, uh, how how do how on earth do you call that? I'm gonna go on a gamble and say particle accelerator, because uh, it's usually like transparent. Um, but yeah, 16.5 kilometers um, after this uh, science interlude, and uh, breakaway still 30 seconds ahead. There's a group uh, four riders that's dropped with uh, Nishimura, Hatsuyama, Neve, and uh, Sima or Chima. Yeah, it's your your usual dropped. Uh, Gasparotto is here. Oh, Moreshko came back. Sorry. Okay, time to uh, make the train nonetheless. We're going to stop laughing for a sec. Nibali behind Caruso, behind Domenico Puzzo Vivo. And we're good. I think. Oh, wait. Behind Nibali. There we go. And now we're good. Alright, breakaway has just been brought back by the peloton, led uh, by Mitchelton, Movistar, Bora. And uh, there's, I mean, De Koninck with Viviani. Guessing he's gonna pace for Bambugons. Uh, West Pazuyo, he's there. Okay. 8.2 km left. Until uh, we reach Frascati. I don't really know where the climb begins. Uh, I'm gonna guess just there, like where the uh, NL uh, boards are located. 6.3 km to go. And there we go. We are in the climb towards Frascati, the finish of this full stage has never been that close. There's already a, a massive acceleration led by Pascal Ackermann, the winner of the second stage in real life. But Antonio Nibali bringing everyone uh, in the peloton. Ackermann tries to go again, followed by Florian Seneschal, the rider from the Quick Quickstep. Elia Viviani tries to take the wheel, but he's going to be struggling. The Italian champion... And there goes Antonio Nibali giving all he has for his leaders as uh, Domenico Pozzovivo is soon going to take his relay. There goes Pozzovivo, Caruso Nibali in the wheel of uh, the small Italian. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to say that's his nickname but that's quite funny. There goes Damiano Caruso, Nibali in the wheel of Caruso. Can Nibali get a second W? On this Giro d'Italia is going to be close between Nibali and Formolo. The runner-up of Liège-Bastogne-Liège. Is he going to overtake Vincenzo Nibali? No, he's not. And the win is for the Shark of Messina. Vincenzo Nibali gets a second win on this Giro d'Italia. Primo Roglic and... Uh, sorry, Davide Formolo and Primo Roglic complete the podium with Simon Yates, Esteban Chavez in fourth and fifth respectively. Damiano Caruso takes sixth position for Bahrain Merida. With Miguel Angel Lopez, Mikel Landa, Bauke Moleman, and Yannis Aguirre in the top 10. Uh, 12th place for Tom Dumoulin, 16th for Domenico Put de Vivo. And that was, a, that was an intense finish But Vincenzo Nibali bringing the W home. Um, congratulations to the Maglia Rosa. Very solid win by Vincenzo Nibali who gets a second slash second and a half uh, win on this Giro his home tour um, and for now having a rather massive amount of success um, more than 50% of race win right now well 50 actually and uh, he's going to increase his lead to 20 seconds thanks to uh, bonus time over Tom Dumoulin Primo Roglic 23rd uh, sorry 23 seconds behind and then uh, uh, nearly a minute already on fourth place Ilno Zakarin Damiano Caruso still in 10th place for us good work by uh, our by our boy um, Lorenzo Rota keeps the blue jersey um, of um, of mountain leader the uh, was it is it Azzurra I think it's the Azzurra the Maglia Azzurra 
at zero four, I think, like blue sky or something like that. I, I, I'm, I could be very wrong. I've never studied Italian. The Cyclamen jersey stays on Vincenzo Nibali's shoulders, who increases his lead to now 41 points over Calabuin. Um, good, good performance as well by Vincenzo here. The best young rider is going to keep to stay. Sorry, being Miguel Andre Lopez. 28 seconds over his first competitor, Ivan Ramiro Souza. Um, and the best team is staying Bahrain. All right. Well, that was a very good stage. Very good stage. Is there been any guy dropped uh, from the 33rd place? Uh, Rafael Maika got dropped. Tao Gegenhardt, uh, I mean, he was not having the best tour of his life. Pavel Sivakov, same. Sam Oman, um Yeah, so, some names dropped. Like, not GC contenders, but some guys that could have done something. Um, okay. Okay. Do we have anyone dropped? I'm gonna guess we've got our, um, was it Garuzio? There we go, losing 3 minutes 40, solid. Uh, Gregor Bolle and Christian Corinne are here. Isn't, is Nibali here? Did Nibali finish in the main group? He did, wow. Brilliant performance by Anthony Nibali. Um, both Nibali doing very good today, with Vincenzo bringing the W home uh, in this fourth stage of the Giro after 230 kilometers between Orbetello and Frascati. The GC uh, looks like this, but you've seen it uh, previously. Tomorrow's stage is going to be between Frascati and Tarasina, 140 kilometers uh, as we start climbing from the start, but then upon that, uh, it's rather flat towards, uh, I'm gonna guess, the coast of Tarasina. Um, so I don't know if we'll be able to do anything, but um, we'll see that. So please. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Hit the bell um, so that you will get notified of all of my videos. There's the Giro, there's the, the Tour of California that's going to be uploaded today as well. Uh, maybe even before the Giro, I don't know. Uh, I'll, have, I'll have to see. Um, but yeah, follow me on my social media, the links are in the description down below. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, that would really help me out. Like, it, it would just mean a lot to me. Um, comment if there's anything you want to say. And. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. I've been back all. It's been an absolute pleasure talking to you today, guys, and goodbye.